every week to make sure people on Hilton Head Island have good food to eat. But as WSAB's Andrew Davis discovered, at Sandalwood Community Food Pantry, it takes a village to make sure the food is ready before it makes it to anyone's table. A community organization making a difference one piece of food, one piece of clothing at a time. It's a labor of love for the folks here at Sandalwood, but it takes a lot of work to make this happen. I think it's a place where people from all walks of life can come, not just the people needing food, needing basic needs that are hungering, but people that are hungering for other things. And wanting to give back. Giving is job one for the 80 volunteers that come to Sandalwood Community Food Pantry every week, and they aren't alone. Second Helpings delivers bags of bread products, meats, and more. And the Hilton Head Social Bakery even chips in with some tasty treats for free. We've been doing that since the beginning because I was in a situation myself when I came on the island where I couldn't, you know, eat myself. 1,200 people are here each month for support in the form of clothes, food, and more. Fresh vegetables, meat, things they can put in a bag, take home, and make sure their family eats well, at least for one more week. Bellaquis Medina isn't here for herself. She stands in line for the seniors who can't show up on their own. This place will give them not the whole situation, but they fix half the, their situation. It does give them hope, you think? Yes. This place means a lot to Wesley Campbell. He's driven to and from Columbia every week for the past 10 years to pick up fruits and vegetables from the farmer's market, driving back at 4 a.m. to make sure the clients have something healthy to choose from. It's a good feeling when you're doing something for people that you know that appreciate it and they really need it. Every day new people come and I think they experience a joy that they haven't in giving. And for some reason in this environment, they it's like a magnet and they just want to keep coming back. Andrew Davis, WSAV News 3 on your side.